bright teacher can make all the difference in a child's future, and sometimes they can inspire their students to follow in their footsteps. At Century High School, we found two English teachers for whom that's true, but their connection goes way, way back, and their story is good news. Jody Kurzman explains. He's great. Teaching here. They do want him to go, right? He's a in hero. In this classroom. How many men does he take with him? It's a full circle moment for Brianna Sorrell. I had English in this classroom. She graduated from Century High School in 2007. Follow along with me, please. Nine years ago. So are they going to say yes? She returned as a teacher. If ever two were one. Maureen McDaniels is one of her co-workers. All she is saying there. She teaches next door. She's been here for 27 years. I love it. They share a love for teaching. Assignments in there. It just For the school and for these students. Nothing. The English teachers and Bradstreet's life she also share DNA. Yeah. Mrs. Sorrells is Mrs. McDaniel's daughter. I feel very blessed that she is so close. Save these people. It wasn't something they ever thought would happen. Beowulf shows up here, right? Mrs. Sorrell spent a few years teaching in Beach before moving back to her hometown. He's a hero. Now they can't imagine not working together. I always know that I have a teammate. She's always going to be on my side. She, she doesn't know how to not be on my side. Students say the mother and daughter connection is obvious when you hear the teacher's talk. I can hear it in their voice. They talk the same. First poem. But while they may sound the same, the Puritans believe Brianna says their teaching styles are different. And I think we have different things to offer each other. Both strive to be great teachers, always learning and helping each other. I have learned a great deal from her. Lessons that she says have made her a better teacher. Let's take a look at and also a better mom and a better grandma in Bismarck. I'm Jody Kurzman, reporting for your news leader. Maureen says she and her daughter spend a lot of time talking about school and their students, but they spend even more time talking about her grandkids, Brianna's three young sons.